Hey, how's it going? Good. Oh, wait, what if you said bad? I just realized. Oh, well, then I hope it gets good. Mm hmm. Look at this friggin' thing. Uh, all right. Yeah. So, as I do from time to time, a base tour. Um, <laughs> where do I start? Okay. So, with the new, you know, canyons being introduced, I definitely wanted to build a bridge across with a weird thing inside. Now, the issue is with this Halloween theme, this clearly Halloween themed base. So this door is locked. Oh, I hear things going on inside there. And these doors are hooked up to these. And because the sun is shining, they won't open. But when the sun goes down, they will open. <laughs> and then there's these things. There's one on each side. Oh, you know what? I should double check. Okay, okay. Yes. What's going on in here? Fireworks, you say? Is my note still here? I think you have to do this to read it out. Doors open when the sun is fully down. Both heartbeat sensors need to be activated for fireworks to go off. Need two people or a motorbike. Uh huh. Interesting. Yeah, so you'll see on this side of the bridge, there's a heartbeat sensor, sensor, as Tuvok would say, sensor. And then on this side of the bridge, there's a heartbeat sensor. Again with this. Horizontal fireworks. Do they work? Yes, I tested them. Okay, so uh, let me just show you this tower. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, Clark's base, a.k.a. My Lucky Llama, just not as good at the game. Um, I don't think he's on, actually. Let me... Uh, I did have my HUD turned off there. No, he's not on. And then uh, I made this tower for people to both get here easier and because, you know, it's ridiculous. So where does this one go? Mm -hmm. Far, needless to say. A far zip line. So we have uh, on this server, which I guess I should say, Librarian Long Place. Monthly PvE with Purge. Feel free to check it out yourself. I will reset this thing that we're going to see at some point. We do have to wait for nighttime. I'll probably have to edit out some daytime stuff. Okay, so yeah, this goes to Outpost. You do have to sort of get up here. Which I think you can, right? Wait, are you even able to get up here? <laughs> You're going to have to find a way. <laughs> oh yeah, we got our little uh, little oasis over here. Mm-hmm. With, you know, your typical... This is actually a purple key card. I know it says red key card. Huh. Wait, it should be purple. Maybe that broke. Interesting. You know, some stuff here. <sighs> These ones used to have vehicles in them, but that <clears throat> plugin stopped working, so I, I did this one vehicle. Oh, uh, no, what is it? Spawn car. Yeah. Okay. Whatever that one is. Uh, everything available in the info. You know what, why don't I just quickly scroll through. I'm not even going to talk about it, but you can pause and read as you like to see if the things available on the server are things you might enjoy. Mm -hmm. And small oil rig is now online, you should know. Mm -hmm. Epic loot. Yes, yes. Commands, there's the zip line. Future plans. Yeah, that one might be nice. And there's the schedule. We are November 3rd will be purge. Okay. Oh, no space there? Hmm. I don't care for that. 
That doesn't make my brain feel good. Um, oh yeah. Okay, so basically, uh, all right, well, the sun is in the west, so that's a sign at least. We're going to cut until night time. Uh, and then I'll show you uh, the base at night because, well, being a Halloween themed and also with fireworks, obviously it's going to work better at night. Oh, uh, I'm going to have to get myself a motorcycle since I am only one person, so I can't set off both these at once. It's actually a little tricky. Hopefully I could do it. Uh, maybe I could do it first try. We will see. Oh, yeah, here's the electricity. A little overkill. I only need three, but I'm so used to putting 10 of these down. Just because it's such a nice round number and you can make 10 at a time. Mm -hmm. This is the, uh, the the timer that opens this door for time enough for the fireworks to go off. And uh, yes, there's trees. Look at this thing. Give you a little outside. Oh yeah, there's definitely things going on in there, isn't there? You can hear them. All right. So I will uh, be back when it is night. I think I actually put a clock here. I did too. There you go. And uh, I'll just edit out starting now. All right. It's nighttime. The doors are open. I may have done this a few times and screwed it up, but I edit all those out. Ooh, the light just came on. Uh, because I forgot that when you're in vanish mode, Heartbeat sensors don't recognize you. Hey. Run, run, run. Oh, wait. Wait, how was I flying? Cool. Actually, let's go back to Vanish Mode to get a look at this. That's pretty cool. You ever seen horizontal fireworks at nighttime? All right. So the uh, the timers, the heartbeat sensor sets off timers that set these off. That opens the door. Whoops. Uh, and then they shoot horizontal fireworks into the inside of the base. Now you could do it one of two ways. You could get two people <clears throat> and just have one on each side of the bridge or do how I did it after several attempts because I'm an idiot um, and ride a motorbike across and it'll give you enough time if you do it quick and don't fall off. Ooh, now for the spooky base. Mm. Oh, who's that looking out? Interesting. Something going on in there. Ooh. Mm -hmm. It's just like a little scene. A little, uh, what do you call it? Kind of like a diorama almost. And these are those uh, clear doors. Let me open one up. Yeah. Available. Oh, I guess you can't do it if you have the HUD off. So if you go to skin, construction here, and I think it's on the last page. Oh, no, there it is. Glass garage <laughs> door. So you got... Quite a selection, but I actually had to add that one. It's not really anything in here. It's just a light in a tree with this guy. Just wanted to show you. All right, so that's it, basically. Nothing too uh, uh, exciting in terms of, you know, a spooky base. Although, some interesting things. And fireworks. Uh, more weird things coming next month. I think I might actually do, uh, as I used to, 
which is record my first day of a wipe. I found a server that I've been enjoying. Actually, why don't I show you what it is? So I think next month I'm going to play on this server. Uh, Rusty Lantern. Low upkeep with Purge. Um, I started this month, uh, seemingly a bunch of nice people on it. And I'm um, in that sort of mindset of... I think I'm maybe... I don't know if I'm done with Fallout 76, but I have been less desirous to play than I used to, let's say. Um, so I, I'm thinking I might want to get back in. Get back into... Uh, Uh, get back into rest a little bit, and maybe that's a good way. So what I used to do, and haven't for some months now anyways, is I would um, record day one of the wipe. As I, you know, find a spot, get that initial set up, that sort of relaxation of that day. Oh, okay, so the sun must be coming up, because the door is closed. Huh, that's kind of cool, right? Right. Um, and then record my like last day. And, and maybe see uh, if we do any raiding or, or stuff like that. So, you know, look forward to that, I guess. Just a short video to show off this friggin' thing. <laughs> this weird, weird thing. Hey, we did it. Uh, end of YouTube video stuff, blah, blah, blah. It's nice to be nice to the nice.